We are at the end game for Dragon Ball Z Kakarot DLC 5. We are now in August and we had six months of V jump scans for this DLC. Now with the last V jump scan being the fight after Goku and Vegeta and showing the aftermath of that, this should be very good for us because we should be seeing another trailer with this DLC with the release date and hopefully for a tease for DLC 6. Now if we do get another V jump scan bro, this is looking very bad for us but I really don't think that's the case but before we go and get to all that my god man we about to go ahead and break it down man but you still got five seconds to choose your option all right if you are ready to play with the new ground mechanics i want you to go right hit the like button and turn on your notification bell but if you don't want to play with it my god i want you to go left hit the dislike button because uh i ain't gonna lie you're delusional all right but again i love y'all appreciate y'all man but i ain't gonna keep y'all for too long Let's go get to this video, man. All right, y'all. So look, man. First thing first, man. Please make sure I watch this full video beginning to the end so do not miss a single detail. We should be at end game with Dragon Ball Z Kakarot DLC 5. All right. Now, I ain't gonna lie, bro. This has been a crazy roller coaster for some odd reason. I don't know why they've been taking so long with this DLC, but I do see why and I don't. I see why because they're in, in like, they put in a whole new mechanic in the game to my, like, ground combat and all that, bro. So, that could be very good for us because they could be putting that in the main game and they could be putting that in DLC 5. So it could be like something like very, very different for the whole type, of, like for the whole game. All right. So that's why I think this is taking so long. But looking at the data files, looking at everything, bro, they still haven't touched zero. I mean, 2.00, bro. It's been almost like almost two months, bro. Almost two months since they touched um, 2.00, bro. We all know that's DLC 6. I mean, DLC 5, my fault, bro. But they is working on 2.10. I mean, 2.01. Um, now, mo most likely, this is just minor adjustments to back up 2.00 and update 2.10. Now, some of y'all think that's DLC 6, which that's what I think. But some of y'all also think that this is like uh, something for the main game, maybe like ground mechanics for the main game or something like that. Because they are still working on these frequently, but they are done with the big main update all right now i'm not gonna lie to y'all bro now it's looking very scary i had to go back to that it's looking very i don't know I, I really don't know like i said bro this should be the month that we should be playing the dlc bro i don't see why not man and the v jumps orders everything but this should be the month if we have to wait a whole nother month bro this is looking bad for kakarot schedules bro but how everything is planned out now everything is turned out bro i definitely think this month should be the month for us to be playing it because if you look at stuff like this like all right so this is the only bad part right here because this dude named Sean again, he said, this is my V jump scan is going crazy. I have a strong feeling without Tenkai Hichi. All right. Now, most likely he posts like V jumps for like, I don't know if he do all animes or just for Dragon Ball, but I know he posts Dragon Ball stuff like that too. Um, If V, if we get another V jump for Dragon Ball for Kakarot, bro, then we're just done. Like we're absolutely done, bro. So we should be getting the trailer for this DLC starting today all the way up to the 16th oh that's when we should be trying to get it bro because we get a v jump scan that is terrible for us bro i ain't gonna lie to y'all man it's like really really bad because that means we have to wait a whole nother month all right now he just did the scans and uh, we did get the sakai i don't know how to say this bro. It's role play name sakaru jump scan kakara sakuru jump scan i don't know how to say it bro it's basically the exact same thing but higher quality and everything that's the last v jump scan we got and he did like a little thing of breaking it down now how he did the v jump scans um that how he did it well not how bandai not how he did how he uh, how bandai did the v jump scans bro this is the last v jump scan for the story bro because each and every dlc show part of part and part and part and part of each every story of this dlc all right we had the goku one after the goku one we had that um supporting characters ones a tn one after that we had the piccolo one after that we had the little outfits one after that we had another goku one with the ground mechanics and stuff like that and this is the final one you know what i'm saying bro this is the thing after the fight after um piccolo after piccolo and goku fight this is what this v jump scan was was after they got done fighting you know what i'm saying bro so this is good now if the last v jump scan we got it was like another them fighting again that would have been kind of bad but since this is the last thing that we have like the after the main fight we got this one that shows that all right we in the last saga you know what i'm saying bro so if we keep going 
um let's keep talking about this bro yeah so that that's the main thing that's why i think we have hope for this why i don't think there's another v jump scan coming out because this is the peel off you already know they're talking about that goku and chichi supposed to be getting married in this one and stuff like that so this is good because like i said this is the one that's after the um fight between goku and piccolo all right but this is the bad part because y'all know i've been talking about this recently on my channel bro because if they're still taking a long time working on this is this early development talking about kakarot still in early development stuff this got a million views golly imagine when this comes out bro this is gonna be heat bro but this is the bad part because they talking about it's in early um it's still in under um under development and stuff like that which this was three weeks ago but i'm hoping that this was old footage and they just released it that is what i'm hoping i'm hoping that this just this wasn't something they did that day and posted it i'm hoping this is old footage but we gonna have to see man but like i said that's the bad thing about this kind of got me scared is this is saying um it is under development up here so i'm hoping that's not the case bro but looking at everything from the v jump scans from starting from the finish bro like i said the first one we ever got pete bro pete the first one we ever got was the goku v jump scan here it is right here and the second one we got the one with tm being playable and stuff like that that was the second one we got the third one we got was the ground mechanics they showed the ground mechanics and everything how the ground mechanics would work the second i mean um the fourth one we got a piccolo v jump scan showing off piccolo showing off his giant form showing off his moves all right this V jump scan was talking about a little bit of the side quest story mode with Goku again, talking about Tien. This one was kind of pointless, but it was a little side quest story mode for this one, all right? And the last one we just got was this one with the end game one, all right? That is how many V jump scans? One, two, three, four, five, six. That is six months, bro. Six months of V jump scans, all right, for this DLC. If we get one more, we are in trouble. Boom. Just letting you know that, bro. If we get one more, bro. So I'm hoping that is not the case, but this month should be the month, man. I don't think no events, man. I don't think it's going to be showing at no type of events. I think it's going to drop at a random, regular day like how they usually do it, bro. Because Kakra, it was only one DLC they did like an event, and that was DLC 3 at, game, um, at Battle Hour. But besides that, I think this is going to be like a random one when we wake up randomly. It's going to be a trailer. Hopefully, to get release date. Hopefully, we get teased tease for DLC 6. And hopefully, that's go well. All right. But that's the main thing I'm thinking, bro. Like I said, man, for the updates and the data files and stuff like that bro is looking pretty straightforward um usually 2.01 don't come out the same day as 2.00 used to be that and a couple of weeks later 2.01 so i don't think like this needs to be finished for the dlc to drop and plus with 2.1 i mean 2.10 um, i don't know what this is i really don't know i'm just speculating that it is dlc 6 if that's the case that means they're working on it very very early if it's not dlc 6 and something with the main game maybe like ground mechanics in the main game or something like that then you know there you go right, right there all right but like i said man i'm really hoping that this dlc really come out bro is i think it's around that time we in august now we got the first one in february i think yeah february damn february oh my god that's six months bro six months that's ridiculous february bro february six months it's crazy bro for this dlc that's insane but like i said bro this dlc could change the whole game because like i said for the ground mechanics and everything they could do something very very big for kakarot man so i'm just waiting for it bro but yeah be on the lookout for it man i really think it's, it has to be this month bro i definitely don't see him going another month waiting for v jump scan stuff like that man so i'll keep y'all updated on that man so let me know in the comment section below how y'all feel about it, bro do y'all think we're gonna play it this month do y'all think that's gonna be next month what y'all think man let me know in the comment section below i love y'all i appreciate y'all and i'm out bro i'm out i'm out president rose